Welcome family, this is Bongiwe from Pumalanga in Elspreet, South Africa. Today I uh, will be showing you how I make my own Nastachium tincture. In one of my previous videos I showed you how I made my own lavender tincture. But then today it's a Nastachium tincture actually a family i make these tinctures almost every year when winter is about to hit i make my own tinctures because i know that flus and colds stuff like that will be visiting so i always try to make my own I use these tinctures even when somebody has got a cut or a wound because it also works as an antiseptic. That's why I use my tincture. There, as you can see, I was washing my leaves to get rid of any soil. It's very easy to do, no complications. Make sure that you get rid of any debt. And then drain the water. As you can see there. Drain the water very well. And with these leaves, the, 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 the water just doesn't even, they don't stick on the, on the leaves. And those are my buckles. You can use any buckle of your choice. As long as you are sure that the lead can fit very properly or can seal very well so that no air can get in the buckle. So I like using console or those ones can see the lead has got a rubbery stuff around to make sure that no air gets in or out. That's my vodka. The vodka easily dissolves the properties that are in the herbs. Some people like using vinegar. But I prefer vodka the best actually then I chop my nastachiums pour the vodka half full in the bottle it's either you chop them or you crush them and then you fill your bottles with your herbs there was filling my bottles then you label them so that you don't forget when last you made them and every two days, make sure that you shake your bottle and you store them in a cool, dry place for six to eight weeks. After those eight weeks, you can then sieve and then transfer them in a brown bottle with a dropper. And that's it. Simple as that. Very easy recipe it's a recipe <laughs> a very easy recipe to follow and those are my tinctures simple as that can use it as an antiseptic as well or if you've got flu coughs you use it there is it well labeled Thank you for watching and stay blessed.